Hello and welcome to the question of the week. I'm Dr. Alvarez and today we'll talk about fertility and pregnancy after your gastric sleep. Now this is a very common subject because being obese can cause infertility issues and sometimes having polycystic ovarian syndrome or PCOS does not help patients looking for pregnancy. So it's important for you to know that just by having the gastric sleeve done can produce a sudden positive change in your fertility. Now, patients with fertility problems should use a birth control option after getting the gastric sleeve because of this. So now the question would be, when should you get pregnant after having the gastric sleeve surgery? It is recommended that you wait at least 18 months after having a procedure like the gastric bypass where you have malabsorption. But I recommend my patients to wait at least 12 months after your weight loss, uh, after your, your, your procedure or your, when your weight has stabilized. The reason for this is quite simple. After weight loss surgery, your body goes through significant amounts of stress. Now going through pregnancy also stresses the body. Now if you, if you add the weight loss, it can pro pose problems to a growing baby. Now the message here is don't get pregnant while you're on your rapid weight loss period. It is important for you to take your supplements uh, during the pregnancy uh, since the most common nutritional uh, complications after weight loss surgery and pregnancy um, are a deficiency of vitamin B12, uh, iron, calcium, and vitamin D. But then again, these deficiencies are more commonly seen around the gastric bypass procedure rather than with the gastric sleeve. So remember that if you have any questions or need help, you can uh, see a nutritionist who's knowledgeable about weight loss surgery. Uh, together with your OBGYN and your bariatric surgeon. Uh, weight loss surgery may actually help protect formerly obese women and their babies uh, from complications uh, including uh, gestational diabetes which that would increase the risk of a c-section delivery, uh, high blood pressure, uh, overly large babies which also increases the risk of c-section delivery. Uh, so another question here would be um, uh, Will you need a C-section uh, for your baby? Now, a C-section is a, a relatively safe way to deliver a baby, but it does carry more risk than the vaginal delivery. There is no medical reason uh, that women who become pregnant after bariatric surgery should require C-section delivery. But then again, they do seem to be more likely to deliver via C-section. Uh, talk to your OBGYN about the chances of needing a C-section. Uh, delivery as well as your preference uh, for delivering your baby. It is important for you to know that uh, pregnancy after bariatric surgery will not affect your baby. So in summary, I want you to take up home this message. Wait at least 12 months after getting the gastric sleeve to get pregnant. Use contraception during your waiting period. Make sure your nutritional needs are, are being met by uh, making sure you're taking uh, uh, your supplements uh, like uh, folate, uh, vitamin B12, iron, calcium, and vitamin D. Uh, it is important to see a nutritionist along with your OBGYN to help regulate the weight gain during your pregnancy and also talk to your surgeon uh, if your nutritionist or your OBGYN needs support. Remember to keep us in the loop. Um, just a quick note on breastfeeding, women who become pregnant after bariatric surgery can still breastfeed. So be sure uh, you and your baby are getting uh, all the nutrition you need. So that's it for the question of the week. I sure hope all this was helpful. Thanks for submitting your questions. Be sure to submit uh, future questions. Uh, uh, I will be answering a question every week. Uh, links will appear right here. You can reach me this way. And I want to congratulate all my uh, patients who have delivered sleep babies this year, especially uh, one of them who uh, delivered uh, triplets. So be sure uh, to subscribe to our channel uh, to receive future notifications uh, um, for future videos and uh, thank you so much for watching.